What's going on guys and welcome back to episode 3 on my channel. Um yes, my voice is sadly still broken. It's uh very it's very upsetting. But um yeah. Uh on the last video I said that I was going to do a dragon raid, which I did and I recorded it, but what happened was um when I pressed stop, like I accidentally corrupted the file. I have no clue how that happened. But I have a feeling I, yeah, I still have the raid over here. Um, it's not that good. I mean, the king was really clutch, but <clears throat> I wasn't looking for the two star. I wasn't looking for trophies, and I could have deployed better. So um, I lured out the clan castle using two dragons. I killed that one, and uh, yeah, let's see how they do. Yeah, there it's two v one. So those two dragons are kind of gonna fly around and take out buildings. That Tesla is not even going to phase the dragons. He's shooting at the wrong one. If he shoot at the injured one, maybe it would have gone down. But, okay, so they're taking out the Tesla now. Um, they're going to take out the goal. It looks like it's a sort of an active base. Well, there was a dragon in there, so I'm guessing maybe not. But, um, it is a premature Town Hall 8. Or maybe, yeah, premature Town Hall 8. Um, or at least new town only. And then I put in all of my dragons and they split up. I forgot totally about funneling. So I think like three dragons went to the center and that was it. Uh, I was a little disappointed. Uh, well, actually only two dragons technically went in at the beginning. So I raged them up and I healed them uh, because that bomb took them out. I raged them again and I was like, hopefully you can take out that dark elixir. But of course there's like two air defenses going against that one dragon. Why would it take out the dark elixir? That makes no sense at all. So, um, no spells left. I got a few dragons. Uh, one just got taken out by a Seeking Air Mine. King goes in. Uh, you'll see that he grabs a two-star from me. I just wanted to see what the king could do. Like, I didn't expect him to actually get to the town hall. Um, but he did it because he is an amazing king. Um, yeah, his, his name is Barbarian. He, <coughs> uh, he is... King Barbarian, but um, he's like banging against the um, walls. I'm like, all right, he has 55 seconds to get to the town hall, and I really didn't expect him to. I'm like, he has like a level seven wall to go through and a cannon shooting at him. Is that like level seven cannon? I have no clue. Maybe level ten? I'm not sure. Um, so he's banging against that wall, and he's like, all right, I gotta get through this wall, and I'm like, okay, you're now like like halfway down in health so as soon as he gets through the wall I activate his ability and those barbarians help him take out the town hall so his ability wears off a little bit too soon is what I was kind of worried about the barbarians tanked for him for a while so there are two archer towers going against him one um uh 10 all 7 maxed archer tower I have no clue what level it is and that looks like it's like level two um but still combine their efforts is en enough to take down the king but not before he takes out the town hall so he takes out the town hall grabs like whatever loot was left and he wins not particularly a lot of loot i mean i wasn't it was really just to practice my dragon raids but i don't think i was looking at the loot um and uh i did actually gain trophies i lost here um on purpose because uh, I was trying to get the last 70,000 and I was trying to drop trophies again to find more farming bases or uh, to farm lower, find more dead bases. Um, here I won and I won a defense. I took a defense uh, before the la last video. So that boosted my trophies up a little bit. But now, as you can see, if you go into my army overview, you'll see I have 40 giants, four level five giants, and um, two rage, one heal. Maybe I should have done two heal, one rage, but whatever. Giants are slow. Um, the reason I'm farming, or I'm like down here in the trophy league, is I don't want to really do this attack like way up high because they're not going to get anywhere. Actually, that's a good amount of loot. If I can have the dragon, uh, not the dragon, the giant's tank, have my king take it out. No, I don't think that's going to happen because the giants are going to go in. The king's just going to go around the whole base because he's dumb. Um, let's see. Yeah, totally, I'll be, actually, it's an inactive base, but I could snipe the town hall because it looks like he hasn't been on since the last, uh, update. But, you know, like, I'm not trying to gain trophies, so. If I had archers, I might have, like, archers and barbarians, I would have gone for. Now, here is a little bit more loot. Um, 
it looks like it's a little bit harder. Um, don't know how I want to go for it. Because my giants are going to take out, they're not going to take out the clan castle. I have to rely on my king for that. Uh, there's a lot of elixir. Well, not a lot, but like a good amount of elixir. Huh. Oh, here's an even better base. Uh, you think you can trick me with your tricky walls? I don't think so. Quite at all. Um, I'm not going to go deploy my troops in that hole unless... Oh, okay. There are defenses. Alright, send a few giants there. So my clan castle giants and a few other giants there. Heal them up. Rage them. And send a ton of giants out. Let's send my king in as well. Um, and yep, the giants are making their way through the base. Alright, go giants, go! Um, there you go. So, uh, let's use the rage here because they have a ton of defenses to get through. The king is kind of just... Uh, the giants are taking for the king, so that's okay. It looks like this might be a three-star. And there wasn't a lot of trophies in the space, so I'm happy about that. Um, so I can keep kind of doing... Why are you targeting the king? Okay, there are a few defenses left, but there's really nothing they can do. There's, like, <clears throat> so many giants going for them. And I have level five giants somewhere in the mix. They might have died, I'm not sure. Now they're going to go and take out the rest of the base. I'm going to wait for the king's ability. I'm not sure if I can get the three-star time is an issue but the giants have swept through all the defenses and see um yeah so yes they did break through the wall question is will they go through that hole and i need these giants to split up sort of um wall breakers would have been nice but they had an opening in the wall so it didn't matter way too much um all right they're not going to split up but they are going to not bang through the walls uh all those giants it looks so cool Oh, there, there, I see some gold. That Those are my uh, level 5 giants from uh, clan leader. Okay, good. Th that giant decided to veer off. I need them to start, like, splitting up and taking things out. I mean, they're, like, doing well, but all right, you're on a long stretch. So once you get to, I think, yep, let's activate his ability. So we take, activate the barbarians, take things out. Um... Because the barbarians, I need them to... Yeah, there was nothing in the clan castle, so that that's okay. Ability has worn off, but they've gotten through the buildings and the giant... Uh, what? Oh, shoot, I didn't even check for builder's huts. Oh, okay, it looks like I'm not getting the three-star. Uh, that's okay. Um, I wish I did. It, it's okay. That giant over there is doing a good job. Good job, giants. You are doing a good job of taking out buildings. Well, okay, they're going to go for the town hall, so I'm going to at least get the two-star, but now it's under a minute. Uh, yeah, they can't do it. At least I don't think so, unless some giants can split up and go for the builder's hut, which I doubt they will do. Yeah, they're not. At least I'll get a high percentage two-star. Okay, they do split up here, which is good, because I need them to go for separate buildings. Um, okay, they're... Uh, if I get, like, a 99%... Too. Sorry, I'm going to be so mad. Alright, now I need you guys to split up. No! Alright. I love how the fattest one of them all is faster than the other ones. Alright, King. Take it out. Two shots, or one shot maybe. Two shots. Barbarians help you. Okay, alright. All right. No, they're not getting it. They can't get all the way across the base. <laughs> um. Alright, that was... Uh, good. Good job, though, Giants. Even if I deployed the giants in the corners, though, they wouldn't have gone for the corners because they're, they're like, defense targeting things. But I did get all the loot, which is what matters. And, um, yeah, and I got my star bonus, so I'm getting... Uh, I can upgrade two more walls by the looks of it. All right. Um, let's upgrade this wall. And let's upgrade this wall. Since we have, like, nothing to spend our gold on but walls, let's just focus on the walls for now. Last Dragon Barrack is going up. I'm not sure if I showed you that in the last video. I probably did. I have a bad memory. Um, yeah, I have no clue what I want to do next. Should I do a BAM raid? Or let's actually just check on the war. And actually, we need perfect war. So we can kind of check on some of the attacks. 
We already saw the attack for one, so let's watch the attack for two. It's 30 to 3. It's not looking so good for NBA troops, but that's okay. Faze was taking out Jake as well. Let's see what Jake's base looks like. I haven't even checked on the war for a while. Um, looks like they got perfect. Uh, good luck. You know, some sometimes people have to start realizing wall breakers break through. They do splash damage, so doubling up your walls aren't going to help you, especially in higher leagues. But whatever, it looks like he's using standard Go Wipe, even though I don't like Go Wipe. Um, this is a premature Town Hall 9. I do have better walls in this Town Hall 9, no offense. But um, yeah, his uh, Go Wipe army, Kill Squad, and Pekka's, that's sometimes what I like to call it, um, it's just going to sweep through the entire base, uh, healing up everything. All right, they got it, or the Faisal's got it. Um, you can guess what happens. They can kind of, they just like go through the rest of the base and take out the corner stuff because they do have fast troops like wizards and archers. And yeah, so of course, and you already know they get the three star. Um, the JP yesterday, um, the in the go white fail, he cleaned up. Okay, he's using the same attack strategy. No, this is a one he attacked earlier. Never mind. <clears throat> The go up fails on number four, and JP attacked set two, so I'm wondering if he uses the exact same attack strategy. Okay, this one's more hog rider based. Uh, let's watch this. I haven't seen this before. Um, I just heard uh, in clan chat people are like, uh, good job, JP, so I'm guessing he took some other base out. So he took out his mirror and the one above him. And I can't wait to record the next clan war because I will be attacking live and it will be recorded. And you know what I don't like the hog rider? Uh, I like about these hog riders, they just kind of jump around and the king and the clan castle just bang at them. They just don't even, they don't even realize it. Didn't, like, I'm pretty sure when the hog riders first came out, they were targeting everything, not just defense, because, um, so they could just jump over the walls and do so much damage. It wasn't really, you know, like, fair, and it, it was an overpowered troop. So they nerfed them so that they only target defenses, which now is also really useful. Um, did they, I'm not sure if they changed any of the, um, like, statistics or made them, like, uh, what is he doing? Oh, he's taking out the um, AI. I, I would have uh, sent some shade at <laughs> the clan castle, because that was a three-star attack. But that's okay, he wanted to get rid of them. Hog Rider's gonna take out the king. Well, actually, they're not. The king is gonna survive. Um, the king, but yeah, but the dragons are just gonna dig him out. Dragons take out the rest of the base. Um, and yeah, GG, uh, JP. That was a good attack. And you know something we haven't done? We haven't looked at attacks from below. Let's watch. The, like, for all the people, like, Town Hall 3s, 4s, and 5s, and 6s, all those people, these are, this is the attack for you, this is number 9 versus number 10, so, um, our number 2 guy didn't have to attack number two, 10, he, he was saying if no one attacks 10, he would be willing to take it out, um, yeah, but Zanik was able to get the 3 star on it, good job to Zanik, he lures out all the Clan Castle troops, Okay, so he sends a lightning spell at them, which kind of does damage to the cannon. Doesn't really take out that giant, but that's okay, because uh, giants are basically like a barbarian with more health. Because they do like the same amount of damage, I'm pretty sure. Alright, so he's going to lure him, lure that giant out further and just surround him. Oh wow, that giant, is that a little three giant? But um, yeah. Back to the main attack. Let's just wait until he starts his main attacking session. Alright, a bunch of archers take him out, and the giant can't walk that fast. He's a clumsy, clumsy person. Um, and yeah, I, I assume he's going to deploy soon. Alright, wall breakers and a ton of giants, archers and wizards to kind of go behind and take things out. So overall, good attack from Zanik. Uh, yeah, GG. Um... Yeah, a hundred percent. Now that has actually given me an idea. The next attack, I don't know what I want to do actually. I might do an all giant again because all giants are really good and they seem to be getting me 
Well, that's a percentage, but this time I'm also going to include five wall breakers. See if that helps. If not, then I'll have to rethink my strategy. And, um, yeah, I do have shortage of production, but that's okay. And, yeah, I definitely needed the two rage one heal because they, like, the giants don't, like, feel like moving. I need to get them to move faster and attack bigger and stuff like that. So they're going to do that. And um, I'll record the next video really soon. But uh, I gotta give my voice a break. So this is going to be the end of this video, sadly. Well, this is Queen Mel signing out.